Okay, so I did this long drawn out video with screenshots and everything and I can't get it uploaded. So I'm going to do something real quick. So first what you're going to need to do is download a torrent program, which I use uTorrent right here. Once you get to the website, you're going to want to click here where it says uTorrent free. You're going to want to download it and install it, accept anything that it wants you to. I've actually already got this file, so I'm not going to keep it. Once it is installed and ready to go, it's actually going to show up like this. And as you can see, it shows the percentage of downloading here which I'm trying not to get too close because it's a touch screen um, and then it shows the download speed and when it's assumed to be gone or assumed to be done and I'm not even going to show what it is but once you have the program you need to go find your torrents I use piratebay.org You're going to need to find your file. I'm just going to do a search for vampires. Actually, no, let's do zombies. O M B I E S. And we're going to do other because that's where the books appear. And pirate search. And unfortunately, there's all these stupid little runny lines in the middle of the screen. Uh, I don't know if that'll be on the end video or not. Um, but over here, the seed, it's best to sort these by the best number of seeders because the more seeders, the quicker it'll download. If it only has one or two, you're probably going to take a few months. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just click Pride, Prejudice, and Zombies. Once you found the file that you want, you gotta go here, click get this torrent. It's gonna pop up your uTorrent. It's gonna ask you save as, you'll click OK. And then as you can see, it started the download already. Now it's just starting, so it's at zero percent. But once that completes, you'll just need to find the file. Which to do that, you're gonna wanna right click, click open containing folder, and voila, there's your stuff. And that'll be everything that you just downloaded. Then you'll need to move them over to whatever file that you want. Now, let's say if you want a Kindle, if you're using a Kindle, all you would do is go into the My Computer. You would find Kindle right about here. Open it, just kind of like, let's say, videos. And then you would go over here. And if you've already right-clicked and select Open Containing Folder, you've got your files right here. These are the ones you're going to want to move to the Kindle. This is just an example. These are not books, so you're not going to actually want to do it with these. Um, then you take the file from here and you drag it and drop it where you want it to be. See, now I'm getting an error because it's still a new torrent. You'll need to stop the seeding before you can actually move it. And to do that, you just right click and select stop. And then I'll just cause it to go finished. Um, that way you'll be able to move it over to the Kindle and unplug the device and you're good to go. That's it. Bye.